This video was recorded in accordance with the Korean government recommendations and guidelines to help prevent the spread of coronavirus to keep all the participants, both in front of and behind the scenes, as safe as possible. Hey, you made it. Thanks for coming. You're here to check out the facilities, right? Yeah, I thought I'd come look around and see what you guys had to offer. Well, that's great. Come on in. Let me show you around. This is the perfect place to be if you're going to bring your business to Korea. There's so much I want to show you. I mean, of course, obviously you can find a lot of this online, but let me give you just a quick introduction. As a member of the KSGC, we start you off with a settlement fund, which is really important to get your feet on the ground, a little money up front, but we also help you with visas, we give you training, mentoring, consulting, support, and of course, your own office space, really important down the hall through those doors. I'll show you that in just a second. Another thing, is you get set up with a Korean intern. And that's pretty important to help you overcome that language barrier. Think about being in a meeting, helps you right there. Also, accelerators, that's important too because not only do they give you advice, but they also connect you to the local business community. And that's pretty important. Ah, right here. This is where you can have a lot of your face-to-face -face meetings. We do a lot of events here. This is important. Gets me through my day. Little cafeteria. Good for getting coffee, as well as some snacks, of course. You want a coffee by chance? Uh, I'm good, thank you. So you guys actually helped me get the visa here in Korea. I heard that was a really hard process. Yeah, that's pretty important. So we set you up with a D10 visa, and that's gonna be the job seekers visa. So it gives you a couple months here while we get you the coveted D84 visa. So that's the technology and business startup visa. That's what you really want. It does take some time though, so that's where the settlement fund comes in, helps you out a little bit. Awesome, okay, so what's next? Over here, this is the global boot camp area. That's gonna be where you work. Oh, over here to this side, this is where the admin are and the team leaders always here to support you, so they're very helpful. Does that mean I need to learn Korean to be part of KSGC? No, you don't need to learn Korean. In fact, the official language of the KSGC is English. So, as long as you know English, you can be here. Oh, after you. So, this is the KSGC working area. If you look around, you'll see a whole bunch of companies with their own spaces working on a whole bunch of projects. It's actually pretty impressive. Anything from, you know, building websites to apps, doing e-commerce, tech-based companies, you name it, they got it here. So, you'll probably find someone in your own sector. So, I see it's called the Case Startup Grand Challenge which kind of sounds a bit like a competition. Is this not like a normal incubator? Are there any rules? Right, so there's two parts of it. One part is the challenge aspect, right? So you can, of course, win prizes and get some money for it. But it's more about bringing in these promising startups into the Korean ecosystem. I mean, that's really what it's all about. As for the rules, your startup or pre-startup needs to be no more than seven years old, and you need a representative who is not a Korean citizen. You're gonna be based in Korea, but you can target both the domestic and international market. Oh, uh, another thing. All you have to do is speak English and be eligible to live in Korea, and you can apply. It's pretty simple. Got it. So where do we get our office space? Right here, in this large open room. Either you get a desk or multiple desks, depending on the size of your team. Also, we have breakout rooms, meeting rooms, and of course the essentials, you know, printing, photocopying, and the high-speed Korean internet. Sounds great so far. So what are the benefits of winning the Grand Challenge? Well, there's about 300,000 US dollars worth of prizes, so that's great. But for the other benefits, I think it'd be better if we talk to some of the people participating in the program, right? Let's go.